we are in the server room and this is a rack that contains the switch and the short tail devices for the telephone. If you can see the uh, short tail name. Here's the uh, switches that connect to the network. Here's the Cisco device. It's a Catalyst 3560. And there's uh, two of them. And they are 48 ports. On the back wall, you can see the uh, phone connections for the previous telephone system. However, the uh, short tail phone system replaced that system. Now we have the wireless wireless unit that you can see on the top here. And actually, there is a controller for the wireless and we're going to look at the back of the unit and this is the back of the unit and this is the wireless it's a Cisco 2000 series wireless LAN controller And it connects to a uh, T1 from uh, Cobad. This is the back. This is the back side of rack number two. We have a monitor on the top. Again, we're looking at the back side. We have a tape unit. We have a backup unit and there's other servers here. Now we're going to look at the front side of the rack. And here we have a temperature sensor. It's uh, 83 degrees ambient temperature. Here we have the keyboard. So this is the keyboard and the monitor for the servers that we control through a uh, KVM switch. Here's, this is a tape backup unit and a network backup unit. This is a Unix, sun, uh, Unix Sunbox. You can see that it's a Sun, sun Microsystems. Here we have a Belkin a KBM switch, a Power Edge 2950, a Power Edge 1950, which is 1U, and a short tail, short tail server for the phone system.